Oh, hi, it's Bukai. So I wanted to make a quick little video for everybody here on how to find Baba Yuga or the house monster for Prometheus here. Uh, it's very simple. You come down here to beans, you kill a bunch of them until you have eventually unlocked this portal down here. Then you wait until the top of the hour. You have to go through the portal before the top of the hour. So make sure you go in like five minutes early. You come in here. Then you hit the auto button, and I'm just going to sit here for a bit. And, oh, one thing that I should do, sign attacks, take mocking shout off, done. Oh, nice, I got the card on there. So, yeah, what you do is you come in here, and you just wait. You wait in here for Baba Yuga to spawn. He will spawn at the top of the hour up to about 15 minutes in. So, just hang tight. And we're back. So, I'm going to show you guys how to kill Baba Yuga on there. He's not too difficult. Uh, he's just guerrilla tactics in order to take him down. And there we go. I have blown up this thing for you. So, all you got to do is just continuously guerrilla tactic him. Hit him every once in a while. And then when he's ready to move, you move up the tree. So, that way you avoid him. So, oops, well that was just crap. Make sure you click on the stem of the tree, don't do what I just did. And to show you guys what my stats are, this is what I have in order to kill him. It's not the best, and it's, it's not terrible, but it's not amazing. Now I'm obviously just doing this horribly, but he is fairly easy to actually avoid. I've got the stats to survive him, but if you don't, then it's fairly easy just to keep clicking away from him make sure you carry food with you because you will get caught on a lot of these red mushrooms which is why you usually want to stay around the actual tree because then you can pop up and down you know what i'm gonna force myself to eat a hot dog to go on this side of him for that exact reason it's a good thing i didn't have my Oh, there we go. So now that he's running this way, I'm going to go up the tree. And let him pass. Pop back down and attack him. Simple, quick, easy. Now by doing this, you get a talent reset potion from Prometheus. There's not really a good reason to go after Baba Yuga as of right now. As he doesn't really... I keep saying he, even though Baba Yaga is a slavish woman or slash banshee like creature out there but yeah there's no real reason to kill him it doesn't give you that good of a uh, stats he has, doesn't really have a good drop rate the only reason why people do is they go to try and kill him to gain the his egg drop which at the moment doesn't do anything and they're holding out for the future content that it might give you a pet down the future but really, I say just just ignore him. However, you know, you guys can do as you will. Kill him if you want, farm him if you want. He spawns once an hour. Do him for the quest, and there we go. He will always drop this flower, which is needed for Daisy's quest down in the tree. So I think you got to get five of them. So there is a reason to go in here and kill him five times. But that there is Baba Yaga. He's not that hard. So long as you keep hot dogs in your inventory, you should be good. Keep a defense. I have mine around 129. However, I've got three parts of the actual Amarok. I'm not wearing a helmet. I'm sure if you can be able to do that with just the boots and iron for the rest. And yeah, that's Baba Yaga. Hope that helps everyone. Take care.